Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 259. Heart Murmurs, Ventricular Septal Defect. Describe the murmur caused by ventricular septal defect. Ventricular septal defect causes a hollow systolic harsh sounding murmur which is loudest at the tricuspid area and the murmur's intensity is increased with the hand grip maneuver due to increased afterload. Describe the murmur caused by mitral valve prolapse. Mitral valve prolapse causes a late systolic crescendo murmur with a mid systolic click. Crescendo means that the intensity is increasing and the mid systolic click happens due to sudden tensing of the chordae tendinae. This is the most frequent valvular lesion, it's best heard over the apex, it's loudest at the S2, and it's usually a benign condition. What can mitral valve prolapse predispose you to? Mitral valve prolapse can predispose to infective endocarditis. What are some of the causes of mitral valve prolapse? Mitral valve prolapse can happen due to myxomatous degeneration, rheumatic fever, or chordae rupture. What are the maneuvers that can increase the intensity of murmurs caused by mitral valve prolapse? The murmurs of mitral valve prolapse can be enhanced by maneuvers that decrease the venous return, such as standing or valsalva maneuver. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.